Okay, here's the botanical gardens, and there's a cafe here. You can get something to drink. There's a refrigerated um, this stuff called uh, 80 plus or 100 plus or something. The mountain is back there. The uh, road that goes up the hill is right there. And I'm going to go this other way, which is over here on the left. I saw it from the bus. And it's called the Moon Gate or something. And this is the path that goes up the mountain. And if I get lucky, I'm going to see some snakes because this is a great spot for vipers and some other uh, snakes. But anyway, you just walk over here on the path. And the moon gate is right up here. We passed it a little bit ago. So here it is from the road. This is the, it's called the moon gate. And it leads to the path which goes up the hill. And I'm going to start my timer right about right as I cross here and see what I can do. It's very steep the first um first little bit. Wow, the first couple kilometers is steep. And uh I mean really steep. There's a lot of steps and some people said they got tired on the steps, but you know, that's what I like is stuff. So I'm carrying a lot of weight. I got three, uh, three cans of this soda type stuff. This 100 plus, and I've got um, camera with lens. I've got uh, MacBook Air. I've got some clothes, uh, stuff like that. So I don't know how fast I'll be able to go up. It'll be interesting. And then uh, I'll be here in a couple of days, and I might be able to do it again if I'm lucky. All right, anyway, I'll get some shots, random shots on the way out, some short videos. All right, cheers. So it starts off with a lot of steps. They're randomly spaced. Some roots. Some single track. Oh, yeah. This is nice. And you could go up that way, but I, I imagine I go the well-worn route. Oh, yeah, this is amazing. This is technical to, to run down. But it's just a joy to walk up. Alright, I'll shoot more video later. I'm going to put this away and try to try to go a little bit for speed anyway. Oh yeah, this is awesome. Alright, later. Okay, this is the first viewpoint. And I made it here in 1220. Just kind of pacing myself. Um, there's hundreds and hundreds of these steps. And uh, oh, so far amazing, but a little too much sun. I thought it was under the canopy the whole time. It's it's maybe half half as sunny, half as not. So it's gonna be real tough. All right, I'll do more later. So you run up through the jungle, and it's totally uh, so nature nature free and wild you know and then uh, you get up here and there's an owl museum dinosaurs alive for kids a squirrel street street uh, performers wow Um, across the water I think is uh, Butterworth there's a bunch of people walking up I think from their cars they don't look sweaty so but you could take this path you could take this um, concrete trip concrete road down or you could take the path so I've almost had enough up here I'm gonna hit the path again and go down oh there's something else up there maybe I guess I'll go up there and see what that is The crazy sound is the dinosaur in there. <laughs> oh boy. 
Anyway, if I'm not mistaken, well, a cab driver told me you can actually run. You can run across all those hills. They all link up. Do I believe him? I don't know. Maybe. That would be cool. But uh, he said part of the trail is closed right now. So which part that is, who knows. But uh, this one, this one was great. It looks, I can't remember what it took me. I'm still running the clock and I don't want to screw it up. Uh, about an uh, uh, hour and eight minutes, I think. So I don't know if that's good or bad. I read that somebody took the road up and he did it in 58 minutes. A runner had that on uh, one of his map my runs or something. So I'm going to go. I'm not going to bother to go up there. I'm going to go uh, down the trail. And I'm going to use the uh, map my run if it works here in Malaysia. It works in Thailand. So um, and then I'll see how far it is. And I'll also see what the elevation is. All right. Ah. Oh, excellent run. That's one of the best runs I've had uh, in the woods. That's the best run I've ever had in the woods, in the forest. It's, it's phenomenal. There's a lot of, the first part is steep, the first couple kilometers, say. And then there's a couple of flat spots, real gentle flat spots, you know, you can run for like 30 meters or something. Then, uh, after, after about half, I guess, starts these long expanses, you know, of, and in the shade too. So I came up about, it's about 11 o'clock in the morning now. But, uh, 10.30, 11. And, uh, yeah, long, like, half a, half a kilometer straight, you know, straight and flat through the soft, on the soft ground, all in the, in the shade of the trees. Really beautiful, perfect. Uh, it's hot today, but I don't know, it's just like Thailand, it's about the same. It's actually cooler up here than it is. Top of the mountain in Thailand for sure. Alright, uh, maybe I'll do a little bit more video on the way down. I didn't take much on the way up because I, I was trying to go for a good time. Sucking a lot of wind. So I'm carrying a lot of weight. Uh, maybe next time I do it I, I won't have any weight. We'll see, just water. Alright, anyway. Bye. Oh! Ouch! I just started filming. I just ripped my finger on this thing. Oh! It grabbed my hat. I reached up to grab my hat and I just tore my finger open on that bush. Well, that hurt. Anyway, I wanted to show you the um, the, the varied terrain here. I mean, there's all kind of stuff. There's it's got everything. So it's got heavy branch covered trail. It's got leave, uh, branches over hanging the trail. It's got this stuff to run through. Uh, it's got trees to climb over, trees to climb under. Oh yeah, it's, it's the variety on this trail is just awesome. I'm having the best time ever. I'm going down now, so not, not at all hard. There's some really steep sections. And, uh, ah, my knees, you know, hurt. Carrying a lot of weight in the bag and then going down steep downhills is no fun. Anyway, uh, maybe I'll shoot a little bit more up here. Try to give you an idea what the whole path is like. Generally, it's like this. Some roots. But nothing, uh, nothing horrible. So you have to watch the ground where you're running, but uh, it's not. I haven't tripped yet, which is a good sign. Got these massive boulders just sitting in the middle of a steep incline. Like, how in the world did that fall there and stay there? <laughs> That's funny. That's crazy. Anyway, all right, I'll film more later.